I Sunil Udra welcome you all in this news bulletin of Saint Soldier Times. We bring you news and views from sports, education, health and culture. Coming to sports, R Pragna Nanda defeated China's Wei Yi 2.5 to 1.5 to book a spot in the semi-finals of the Chessable Masters 2022 online tournament. The 16-year-old will take on Anis Giri of Netherlands in the semi-finals. World number 1 Magnus Carlsen will take on China's Ding Liren in the other semi-final clash. Giri and Carlsen scored comfortable wins over Aryan Tori of Norway and David Anton Guzaro of Spain. In the quarter-finals against Wei Yi late on Monday, the teenaged Indian star opened with a win with black pieces in 90 moves. He built on that fine start to take the second game of the four game match to go 2-0 up the chinese star bounced back to claim the third game of the series to reduce the margin a draw in the fourth was enough for the indian grandmaster to seal a spot in the semi finals pragnananda had created a stir earlier in the preliminary phase by beating world's number 1 magnus carlsen in the sixth round He finished fourth behind Anish Carlson and Ding Liren. The two other Indian players P Hari Krishna and Vidit Gujarati finished outside the top 8 and failed to make the cut for the knockout bracket. Coming to education. Orison will soon launch learning studio in 1 lakh villages in the nation to bring a cutting edge learning environment. The online platform invests its time and money in schools and colleges to transform them into research and knowledge centers. Through thorough research and innovation at its core, Orison aims to create world-class institution for students worldwide. Orison being a research-based company has found out that among 132 countries globally, India ranks 100 as second. in global innovation index rank 2021 in education a country of 464 million young minds stands at rank 77th in the number of researchers the organization was motivated to invest in schools and colleges as they believe that institutions in india must move from imparting knowledge to creating knowledge students and teachers must work together with energy and vigor to further build upon the existing knowledge of society founder and ceo piyush keshav stated in this evolving time where technology has rapidly changed our lives it's time that we do some innovation to create magic in people's lives to create wonders educating the masses is very necessary and looking at this i along with my team came up with the innovative thought of opening studios in villages in villages education usually lags behind but students can access the modern day syllabus and remain equipped with modern day learning main focus of orison is on learning and industry experience which will go hand in hand and teachers will be paid for studying and exploring and with the use of technology intelligent machines will take care of teaching and examining coming to health india on monday expressed strong disappointment over the manner in which who report on excess all cause mortality estimates related to covid-19 was prepared and published in his address to the 75th session of World Health Assembly in Geneva Union Health Minister Mansukh Mandavia said that the WHO ignored the concerns expressed by India and other countries over the methodology and sources of data Mandavia said the WHO set aside country specific authentic data from the statutory authority of India He told the World Health Assembly that the Central Council of Health and Family Welfare, a constitutional body having a representation of health ministers from all states in India, had passed a unanimous resolution urging him to convey their collective disappointment and concern in this regard. In a report released on 5th May, the WHO estimated that nearly 15 million people were killed globally either by the coronavirus 
और बाय इट्स इम्पैक्ट ऑन ओवरवेलम्ड हेल्थ सिस्टम इन द पास टू इयर्स मोर देन डबल द ऑफिशियल डेथ काउंट ऑफ सिक्स मिलियन मोस्ट ऑफ द फर्टिलिटीज वर इन साउथ ईस्ट एशिया यूरोप एंड द अमेरिका द रिपोर्ट्स हैड एस्टिमेटेड 47 सेवन लैख एक्सेस डेथ्स इन इंडिया दिस असेसमेंट वॉज स्ट्रॉन्गली कंटेस्टेड बाय द गवर्नमेंट विच साइटेड फ्लॉड मेथडोलॉजी इन एक्यूरेट सोर्सिंग ऑफ डेटा एंड इनकसिस्टेंसी इन क्राइटीरिया स्टेटिंग दैट पी एम मोदी हैज हाईलाइटेड द नीड फॉर स्ट्रेंथनिंग ऑफ डब्ल्यू एच ओ टू बिल्ड अ मोर रेजिलियंट ग्लोबल हेल्थ स्क्योर आर्किटेक्चर अमंग अदर थिंग्स Mandavia said India is ready to play a key role in all these efforts. And last culture Hollywood actor Jeff Goldblum opens up about his love for India and reveals the thing which connects him to the Indian culture. He says I am not a yogi but a student of yoga and that has only led me to more humility. There's a string which ties Hollywood actor Jeff Goldblum with Indian culture. and it is of yoga and he confesses that it is further strengthened by his inclination towards indian spirituality on the video call with an indian newspaper he goes on to show paintings of guru yoganand and muktanand at his house which reflects his deep admiration for indian culture the actor says i have been a kind of a devotee and has been exposed to indian spiritual thought The painting of Yogananda on the wall has been done by my sister who is also very deep into the Indian culture so I have read about it a lot and have been very interested in it he adds I am not a yogi I am a student of yoga from what I understand it to be and do meditation I have been exposed to much in that realm my studentship has only led me to more humility I have realized how little I know and how much I have got to go to keep training myself and in how to live correctly and in an optimal way this is all in the news bulletin today stay connected with sent soldier times on facebook and youtube